Greetings to you all and many blessings. The image of God, defaced, not erased. The image of God that Adam and Eve were made in was not erased in the fall, but defaced. Through Christ, the defaced components of God's image, original holiness and righteousness, are restored and renewed in our rebirth by the Spirit and sanctification by the Spirit. As God is good, so too was Adam endowed with righteousness and holiness pertaining to his will and his affection. Ephesians 4.24 This part of the image has been badly impacted by the fall and redemption restores it. To err is human, but to err is fallen. We are not human because we sin. We are less than fully human because we sin. And will be made most human when we sin no more. Grace restores that image. As God is rational, so also is man. As God is personal, so is man. As God is moral, so also is man. Man's life is sacred because we are made in the image of God and so should be treated as so. Genesis 9, 6. The fall of Adam, original sin, our being born in corruption and guilt, does not erase the image of God in man. We know this from Genesis 9. As God speaks to Noah of the image of God in us, the basis of human rights in our culture. We were created by a transcendent sovereign God who vested us with his image. Man goes on forever in personal, self-conscious knowledge, thoughts and action because God has breathed into man life, all part of God's image. The first words from God to man were blessings, Genesis 1 28 and God blessed them and God said unto them be fruitful and multiply and replenish the earth and subdue it and have dominion over the fish of the sea and over the fowl of the air over every living thing that moveth upon the earth created unevolved to be made in the image of God means to be made distinct from the animals Repeatedly in the creative creation narrative, animals are made after their kind, but man is said to be made in the image of God. Fallen man has the defaced image of God after Adam, but to be restored in Christ, the new Adam, man is unique. We are uniquely endowed with certain communicable divine attributes. Man is not the human animal. Man is not just smarter than the animals. He is of a different type from the animals. Subdue and rule over the earth. Dominion and rule needs attributes of rationality, moral judgment and righteousness. Colossians 3, 9-10 Do not lie to each other since you have taken off your old self with its practices and have put on the new self which is being renewed in knowledge in the image of its creator. Sanctification is restoring the components of the image, restoring knowledge written in our heart. They want to obey the law that is written in our hearts, a love of God in our hearts. We call him Father. He calls us his children, adopted children in Christ. I will be a father to you, and you will be my sons and daughters, says the Lord Almighty. 2 Corinthians 6.18 Peace be with you.